EFF Julius Malima is so cunning. I still repeat myself. If you have to interview this young man, you must know your story. Look at how we destroy this BBC journalist, the, the so-called the best journalist who can trick you with questions. But Malima knows how to put this man in his position. He completely destroyed this BBC journalist and now we take control of the of the driving seat. Listen to what he said, Malima, as he was interviewed by this uh, BBC so-called big interrogative journalist. Proper guy. I mean, I don't want to go too far back into history, but at various times you failed to actually file a tax return on time. Yeah. You've been accused of different financial offences. You've never been convicted, yeah. but though some of those yeah. uh, charges were never brought to court. But you tell South Africans, despite your own history, you are the guy to run their economy. That's why, that's the mind of a lazy person who doesn't do his work. You, you will have to refer back to 15 years. I'm, I've grown up uh -huh. over a period of time, build a solid political party. The only thing you can keep on referring to it's what you interviewed me about it 12 years ago. Get something new, my brother. No, I'm very... Show a skill of an, a hard-working presenter who does his research. You can't falter me. Since I've made my mistakes on text when I was very young, when I was almost 27 years old, fix that problem. Today, I'm a 42-year-old married man with children who has taken responsibility and built a solid party to be the third largest party without the support of white monopoly capital and the owners of the South African economy. You keep on referring to old and old things because you are now beginning to sound like a scratched CD.